Dakota Electric Association has always been a supporter of renewable energy and we're really excited about the electric bus as that next step in this new technology. Well this bus is the result of a partnership on a pilot project between Great River Energy, Dakota Electric Association, our member, and their member, Schmidt & Sons Transportation Company. So probably the, one of the best parts about the bus is just how quiet it is. It has the same power, feels the same, drives the same as a, as a diesel bus that it's programmed to do. Well, when we looked at the electric bus, we thought it was perfect for a school bus route. When you think about a school bus route, it's the defined mileage. Um, it starts and stops a lot, and you know exactly what you need to do each day. And so with the electric school bus stopping and starting, the regeneration system generates electricity every time you release your foot from the accelerator and puts power back into the battery packs. And that's just a real plus when you think about a school bus doing that all day long. It is expected to add 20% to the range of the school bus. In addition to that, there's no emissions. The bus is safe, it meets all federal and state regulations. In addition to that, one of the questions we get is what is gonna happen when the bus pulls up the children and there's no noise? And one of the things the bus does, it starts playing music when the bus gets below a certain speed. Well, it will demonstrate that electric buses can work here in Minnesota, and we know they can in colder climate because they work in Quebec but it will also show the regional economics and fuel and maintenance savings that an independent transportation provider like Schmidt & Sons can realize by changing to an electric option. Well, this is the first ever all-electric school bus in the Midwest. And in fact, there's only about 100 of them rolling around Canada and the United States today. So it's an early innovation. Uh, it's proven though, and we're happy to have it here in Minnesota. You know, an electric school bus makes more sense, number one, just from an overall emission standpoint. I mean, there's zero carbon footprint, and this bus is fueled 100% on wind energy through our Revolt program. And also, there are a great deal of operation, maintenance, and fuel savings that a transportation provider can achieve through going electric. So we're real excited about that technology. We believe it's just a great partner with partnership with Smitty and Sons and Great River Energy. And I do believe in the quote they said, this is the bus of the future.